Well, let's talk more about this. We've been dealing with this rain all across the region, but it was a false alarm that sent people in Lynchburg into high alert today. The National Weather Service had originally said that there was what they've called an imminent failure of the College Lake Dam, but that has since been corrected. However, everybody is still looking at it, and for obvious reasons tonight, 10 News reporter Lindsay Kennedy is live in Lynchburg. And Lindsay, uh, you just spoke with city officials. What are they telling you? You're exactly right. There was a false alarm. The College Lake Dam is holding, and officials are keeping an eye on it. As of right now, no one needs to evacuate. But I want to give you a look at how powerful this rushing water is. Just take a look at that. There has been a lot of rain that's hit Lynchburg, and flooding has closed several roads. The College Lake Dam is at stage two, which means they're monitoring the levels. It wouldn't be until stage three that the city would consider evacuating people. The director of the city's water resources, which owns the dam, tells me they were a little less than a foot from reaching stage three, but the water levels have gone down. If you remember, back in 2018, families had to be evacuated because the lake reached a dangerously high level. Even though more rain is forecasted for this evening, city officials tell me they have everything under control. At this point, we're going to continue the mon to monitor the situation as we have uh, in recent past. Um, but at this point, we don't see a need where evacuations are necessary. This is a pretty typical event for us. We come out here every time it rains or many times even when there's just a threat of rain. We have regular programs set up to do our monitoring, and today is no different. Tonight at 6, I'll tell you how city officials will be monitoring the lake levels throughout this evening and overnight. Reporting live in Lynchburg, I'm Lindsay Kennett, 10 News, working for you.